The League of Women Voters Naperville recently held two forums to give voters a look at candidates running for office. Republican candidates for the U.S. 6th Congressional District, Jeannie Ives and Jay Kinsler, started off the night discussing things like immigration reform, race and gender discrimination, and gun safety. Well, my change in gun laws would be that we enforce the gun laws we have. We're just not doing it. We have plenty of gun laws in the state of Illinois. And uh, so until we start to clamp down on gun crime, we're not going to get anywhere here. I am a, a big proponent of the Second Amendment. I believe the Second Amendment protects us and all the other amendments. Um, I do believe that there needs to be restrictions on gun ownership of people who are mentally ill, people who are domestic abu abusers, and people who have a criminal record. Ives is a former member of the Illinois House of Representatives, and Kinsler is a doctor and surgeon. The winner of that Republican primary will face off with Democrat incumbent Sean Caston in November. After an hour of questions, the forum concluded and moved on to the next set of candidates, social worker Danica McMillan and director of global data and investment firm Morningstar, Janet Yang Rohr, who are both running as Democrats for Illinois' 41st representative district. They took questions on balancing Illinois' budget, election security, and climate change. I believe that we need to pass through the Clean Energy Jobs Act um, that's been pass in the House, but not necessarily the Senate, um, because it's going to create more jobs, also get us closer to our renewable energy goals. Climate change is real, and uh, we have a moral obligation to our children, our grandchildren, and, and generations to come to, to address it now before uh, it does, before we do irreparable harm. And we need to do this with businesses, as the questioner you know, asked about, but we need to do it at, at so many other levels, too. The winner of that primary will go against Republican incumbent Grant Worley. Both primary elections will be held on March 17th. Reporting for Naperville News 17, I'm Casey Krajewski.